He withdrew her. I was about to take her down, kind sir. Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon? Oh no. And welcome back to a new part of Yu-Gi-Oh! Poke Duel. When we last left off, we cleared off the Rocket's hideout uh, by defeating Mr. Giovanni. And uh, thank you, Matteo Pepe, for commenting and confirming uh, one of my suspicions in, the, in that fight, uh, that Vors Raider was actually holding an item that increases the critical hit ratio. So, uh, yeah, if you want to obtain that item, you can get it by capturing a wild... Force Raider or a Wild Battle Ox because he holds the same item. So thank you Matteo as always for your useful comments, uh, they are always appreciated and I would like to thank two other individuals who also commented on my previous part. First is Davi who commented about a quest uh, that's available in Saffron City in this version of Drumhack. Uh, I will definitely check it out Davi when we get there so thank you. Also, Superhero ZX, uh, he gave us uh, plenty of uh, great pieces of information. First is that Poison Heal, uh, it heals 1 over 8 of our total HP for Myotismon. So that's regardless of being poisoned or uh, badly poisoned. And it acts as a shield against uh, other status inflictions like paralysis or sleep. So yeah, thank you very much Superhero ZX for that information. And he told me that... Uh, Slot machine is actually only obtainable through um, playing the slot machines, ironically. So let me... I just want to check if I... Yes, there is slot machine. If I... Wow, triple ones. <laughs> it should have been triple sevens, I know. Uh, so where do you dwell? Area unknown. Hmm, so maybe you are right there, uh, Mr. Superhero, that... Slot Machine, who has three ones at the moment, <laughs> and yes, three sevens in the artwork, um, dwells only as a prize from playing the slot machines. That is ironic, and I love it. <laughs> that is uh, something that I don't think has ever been done before. Are there Pokemon that are exclusive as prizes? I, I guess so. I remember Scyther. Was Scyther ever available outside of the... Slot machine? I don't think so. So maybe it's Scyther. So I think the mechanic is not new, but it's new to me. So um, thank you, Superhero, for that information. And wait, I can avoid you, that girl? Has that ever happened before? Can you always avoid <laughs> encountering this girl right here? Or is this something just in this ROM hack? I don't remember. Look, look, see my Pokemon. I like the grass type. I like how they're easy to raise. Uh, who do we have up front? I forgot to check. Gemini Elf versus our Injection Fairy Lily! <laughs> Very nice. Alright, let's set up Toxic Spikes here. Wow. Alright, you're gonna taunt me now? Well, I guess I'm gonna attack you with Aerial X. Hmm, I don't have anything that's super effective against you, so tell you what. I would like to see Dremojumon in action. Not very effective, and the Rocky Helmet is going to deal damage to you, Gemini Elf. I, I wanted you to hit more, but that's totally fine. Goodbye, Gemini Elf. Harpy Lady Sisters. Um, Alright, so I will switch now. So our Injection Fairy Lily to see the effect of Venoshock. Or, oh no, I think they are flying. So it's actually not gonna affect them. 
I totally, totally uh, misjudged that, so let's use it anyway. Wow! Very nice amount of damage there, Injection Care Lily. Nice work! And you barely survived, Harpy Lady Sisters, but I will take you down with Aerial Ace! No! Well, you're no match to our Injection Fair Lily, ma'am. Um, and I think I will lead with our Dread for the next encounter. Man, uh... Avoiding this girl right here means we only have two encounters until we <laughs> capture Weevil. Uh, pleased to meet you. My hobby is dueling. Well, mine too. What's your name? Lori. Dark Magician Girl. Hello. Well, I'm, a, I'm sorry to do this to you, but I have Crunch against you. You have Dark Burning Attack! I respect that! Oh! Splendid! Oh well, so I think I will not face Weevil at the moment, because there is a strategy that I would like to confirm if, it, if I'm able to do it, based on Superhero's uh, comment here. I would like to use the Dread's ability to fly to go here. Now, I'm gonna heal at the Poké Center, and I will try my luck against an encounter in Rock Tunnel. You will see what I'm trying to do here, guys. Just give me one second, please. Um, did we collect the item here? I think there's an item hidden here. Yes, Super Potion. All right. Hello there, Mr. Setukaiba with green hair. So, I need a random encounter. Anyone would like to volunteer? I could have used the Dex Nav, by the way. <laughs> Hello there, Ryu Ren. Well, before we encounter Weevil, I thought of activating my Otisman's uh, Toxic Orb. So I have to switch to activate the turn where we are poisoned now. <laughs> so he becomes poisoned when we go to Weevil. So I think that is perfect. Uh, so let's now use Injection Fairy Lily to fly back to Celadon. Thank you very much, Injection Fairy Lily. Now let's put Rayakushim powered up front, and Myotismon is now already poisoned, so that is great. So he's not afflicted by uh, Great Moss Sleep Powder or Stun Spore, if you have that as well, Weevil. So my Tisman is gonna come really handy against uh, the fourth gym leader here. <laughs> Look at all the pretty ladies! I'm going to crush you like a bug in front of all of them! You have no chance against my insects! Prepare to lose! <laughs> I always love to make Weevil uh, voice. Um, and I just remembered now. <clears throat> he has our ace monster with him in the team. Oh, Launcher Spider, hello. As expected, you come first. Wait. I wanted to save Rock Slide for other monsters, but you know what? Ah. Uh, I will have to use it against you, Launcher Spider, that's totally fine. It's not a waste in any way. Yep, takes you down in one, so it's not a waste. But I, I would have preferred to use it against 
other of Weevil's insects. Insect Queen, though. I will keep Rayfish empowered in. He's going for the Queen right away. Hello there, Insect Queen. Alright, one more and she goes down. Attack order. Whoa! Whoa! What did you do there, in Insect Queen? Um... Alright, that made me scared a bit. <laughs> Let's face Insect Queen with our Dread. And against you, I will use Dracarys! Alright, you go down, but that was a very powerful attack, Insect Queen. I love the fact that it has bees <laughs> drawn on the screen. Neo Eater Bug. What do I have against you? I will send Remotion on out for you. Alright, we don't have anything super effective, but I have Crush Claw, which will decrease your defense. Wow, it does not. Okay, he's becoming a glass cannon at the moment. Okay, deals more damage. Razor Shell, super effective, takes down our Dremogemon. Rocky Helmet <laughs> does damage on the way out. That's not good. I will summon you, Jama King. Razor Shell. Okay, defense fell, but... Okay, doesn't deal as much damage as... Uh, okay, X Scissor, though. That's not good. What is that? Oh no, Jama King! Don't go down! Come on! Okay, he's paralyzed! So this next move should take him down! He withdrew him on the last second! Poison Butterfly! Leech Life is gonna take down our Pajama King! Oh no! Okay. I will now summon our Injection Fairy Lily! You withdrew Poison Butterfly. Neo Eater Bug. Alrighty then. He goes down. Thank you, Injection Fairly. Perfectly ultimate great mod. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm not gonna switch Injection Fairly out. I want her to face perfectly ultimate great mod. Bring her on, Weevil. There she is. In Oracle. In all of her beauty. She is not on our side this time. Smart strike, though. <gasps> she has a steel type move against Injection Fairy Lily? Oh no! That's not good at all! Another smart strike is gonna take down our Injection Fairy Lily, unfortunately! So, there are only two left the Dread and Myotisma. So, against you, I will use Dracarys! Wow, she survives it! Okay, this one... It's not very effective. Alright, the Dread takes down perfectly ultimate great mark! And I will use Dracarys against you, Poison Butterfly!
Now, Great Moth time. Now, I remember Great Moth had this uh, uh, strategy of using uh, Sleep Powder and Stun Spore, so my Tismon time to shine. I hate you! Well, sorry about that, Weevil. But you did <laughs> take down our injection fairly using perfectly ultimate Great Moth, which I don't appreciate, by the way. Wow, that's a lot of damage. Poison Heal is gonna heal up some of our health back. Um, can I use Sucker Punch against you? Yes. Okay. Hmm, a lot of damage again. Wow, my Otisman goes down, unfortunately, and that leaves our last monster, the Dread, against Great Moth. Now, hopefully we become faster and you don't inflict sleep on us, so, Drakkar with Dread. Goodbye, Great Moth, and with that, we have defeated Weevil Underwood <laughs> to obtain our fourth gym badge. You suck! <laughs> This isn't over. I'll get my revenge one way or another. Just take the rainbow badge and leave. Well, I, I just want to rub it in your face, Mr. Weevil, and uh, that's for our uh, Exodia piece that you threw. The rainbow badge will make monsters up to level 50 obey. It also allows monsters to use strength in and out of battle. Take this with you and get out of here. Giga Drain. I remember I gave that our perfectly ultimate great math and it did wonders, but now we don't have anyone, I think, who can learn it. Half the damage it inflicts is drained to heal your monster. You'll need to use it on yourself when I'm through with you. <laughs> I like that dialogue. You are cataloging dual monsters? I don't care. Leave before I order my insect queen to attack you. Okay, Weevil. <laughs> okay, now that we have the fourth gym badge, that is awesome news. Sir, what are you doing? Okay, um, let's use <laughs> the dread survive the battle with Weevil. Um, should we go here, Lavender Town? Because now we can heal everyone back up and enter the Pokemon Tower, and we have the Move Tutor too unlocked. So we need to check that out. We have a level cap unlocked too, but I don't think I will use rare candies from now on until I absolutely have to. Um, let's have fun without them for a while. Thank you, Nurse Joy. So, sir, what have you unlocked for us? Fire Punch. Could be useful. Mm, no one can learn it though. Okay, I have to wait. Ice Punch. No one can learn it. Thunder Punch could be useful. No. Signal Beam. Tailwind Bullet Punch. Hmm, interesting. So this badge is like fight, <laughs> fighter type oriented or something. Super Fang. Venom Drench. Okay, okay, let's take it one move at a time. No one can learn that move. Super Fang. Okay, what is it for my Atisman? A normal type move. The user attacks with sharp fangs and halves the foe's HP? That could be very powerful. I mean, 6100, 7100, and attacks first. So maybe I should replace one of you. Afflicted by a status problem. Repulsive wind is used to enemy. Also raise all the... It's not... It's not guaranteed though. So tell you what, I will learn Super Fang on my Otisman. And let's see what else do we have. Stomping Tantrum. 
All right, Rakish Empowered. What is it? Ground type move. 75100. If the user's previous moves have failed, the power of this move doubles. Wow. Okay. Um Is it worth it though other than dig? Dig is a two turn move. 80. This is 75100 and the added bonus. If it failed, the power doubles. Could be very useful. So tell you what, I will learn it instead of dig. And give him a bad tantrum for our Rikush Empowered. <laughs> so, what else? Venom Drench. Yes, that's the one I'm excited about. For our Injection Fairy Lily, of course. The user sprays a poisonous liquid that lowers attack, special attack, and speed of poisoned foes. I thought it would be a damaging inducing move, so no, I will not learn it, sorry. Man, it had a cool name though. Rock Blast. Wait, can that be a more powerful rock type move for our Ryukush Empowered? 2590, the user hurls 2 to 5 hard rocks at the foe to attack? No, sorry. Um, what we have is already better. Breaking Swipe. It's a dragon type move, if I remember. Um, do I want to replace anything on the dread at the moment? 6100. Hmm. No. There is nothing here that I would like to replace. Weather Ball. Okay, a lot of people can learn it, so let's check Ojama King. What is it first, and let's see if it suits him. Normal type move. An attack that varies in power and type depending on the weather. Um, 5100 though, so no. I will not learn that, sorry. Bug Buzz. Man, we don't have a buck type in our team! <laughs> we don't have our Kuzuaman! Cross Poison. Again, something for our Injection Fairy Lily. Let's check it out. 7100, an attack with a high critical hit ratio. It may also poison the foe. Interesting. 65100, that becomes double if he's poisoned. Do you really want me to replace Aerial Ace or something? Hmm. So, make them poisoned with this, hit them with Venus Shock. <laughs> uh, you know what? I think I will try that. Let's make her <laughs> moveset. Three poison type moves and one fairy type move. And keep Aerial Ace on other members. Okay, let's try it out. Cross Poison for Injection Fairy Lily. Psycho Cut. No one can learn it. I would have wanted to check that out. Okay, so now... Ryukush Empowered is up front. Excellent. Uh, I would like to... Wait. Before we go to the Pokemon Tower, let me check my Otisman's moveset. I have something in mind that I said I would do before. Sucker Punch, Super Fang... Halves the foe's HP is very good. Ghost type and Bite, which may make them flinch. This is more powerful and attacks first, as long as they have an attacking type move. Um, okay, I wanted to equip our Mytisman with switch Switcheroo, the movement that replaces the um, Poison Heal with other um, opponent monsters with the item that they hold, but you know what? I don't think I will do that. Oh, so you have your fourth gym badge? 
Excellent. Hello, Mr. Burns. You may now enter the Pokemon Tower. Thank you. Anything different here? No. And there he is, Mr. Rival Jaden or Nia, or this time it's Jon Snow. Hey Adam, what brings you here? Did your cards get banned? <laughs> of course not! Your deck is garbage! And I'll prove it after I defeat you. Let's go. Well, let's duel Mr. Jon Snow because apparently you know nothing. Winkuriba. Hmm. I have bad news for you, sir. I have Rock Slide powered by a ground gem. Yawn, though. Is it a ground gem? It's a rock gem, sorry. And it hits! You barely survive, though. Do I have... Sucker Punch? Not guaranteed. Not guaranteed at all. You know what? I will switch. There is no need. Um, who has Aerial Ice? You do? So the Dread will come here. You have Quick Attack too. But I would like Aerial Ice... Um, roll out. Okay. Yeah, Aerial Ace is more beneficial against Wing Kuribo, just in case he uses Multiply. La Jin. Um, he's a Rock type, so I think... I wanna check my Otismon's... Yeah, he's a Ghost type, so my Otismon should do very well against him. And let's check this move. Oh, it's not gonna be... But let's check it. Is it really gonna have his HP or not? It doesn't affect him. I chose the wrong opponent for this. <laughs> Hypnosis hits first before our poison. Wow. Wow. Super effective. Takes my this one down. Well, that's unfortunate. Huh. That's really unfortunate. If he had used any other type of move other than Hypnosis, I think we had, we had this in the bag, but Sucker Punch did take us down. Ah, oh, that's, uh, that's unfortunate for my Tisman. Thank you for the citrus berry. He woke up and chose violence. <laughs> Goodbye, Lajin. Flame Swordsman. You know what? I think this is another um, mission for our Rapish Empowered. Check Bat Tantrum. I didn't see that in action yet. Will O Wisp. Okay, super effective. Doesn't deal a lot of damage though. And Rough Skin is gonna hurt you, Flame Swordsman. Excellent work. Wow, that dealt a lot of damage. And let's do it one more time to take him down. Wow, he avoided the attack! <laughs> oh well. I I will throw a bat tantrum myself for this. He took him down, but Rough Skin will also take Flame Swordsman down. So, thank you, Ryukush Empowered. You sacrificed yourself to take down Flame Swordsman. How nice of you. So, who comes next? I think I, regardless, I will send out our Injection Fairy Lily! Dark Magician Girl! Hello! 
So, against you, I will use Drain Kiss. Is that super effective against us? Are you kidding me? Takes down our Injection Fairy Lily in one hit? That's not good. That's not good at all. That is not good at all. He withdrew her. I was about to take her down, kind sir. Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon? Oh no! We... Oh no! Um... I will switch to our Dremogemon here, but really, I need our Dread against Dark Magician Girl, so I need to take this one down. White Lightning does not affect Dremogemon. Ladies and gentlemen, I did not plan this. <laughs> Thank you, Dremogemon, for having this ability. It's really nice. So, let's use Crush Claw against you to decrease your defense for our Jama King to come and take you down if need be. Burst the stream! Not very effective, sir. He avoided the attack, unfortunately. Come on, I need a few more good hits. Okay, that's a very good hit. Awesome work, Drimojimon. Come on, one more. I I will not risk as Team Roller does, so I will use Crush Claw one more time to take down Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. Drimojimon is victorious. Dark Magician Girl. You know what? I know I can take her down with the Dread, but I want to give this victory for Ojama King. Um, Chaz? Come here, please. And take down Dark Magician Girl using Fly. Oh, you have Psychic, though. Um, so, my, wow, that's a lot of damage. My intention was to <laughs> take her out using Fly, but I don't think that will happen now. Yeah, I think that's a lot more damage than I would have liked. So Jama King goes down. Alright. Initial plan then. It's the Dread. And against you I will use Quick Attack. Critical hit. Awesome work Dread. Bow down in fear Jon Snow. What? Of course I lost. What? What do you mean? Your deck doesn't comply with the ban list. I have a monster that... That gets summoned by using Metal Morph on Red Eyes Black Dragon, sir. What what more do you need? <laughs> what do you need? How's your Pokedex coming? I just caught a Drillroid. Well, good for you. Now, if I can just find Power Bond, I'll be set. Power Bond for Drillroid? Oh, in order to, of course, um, Power Bond. I thought it worked on Cyber Dragons only. No, it works for all Machine Fusion types. Of course it does. I just uh, forgot that. Well, I better get going. I've got a lot to accomplish. Unlike you. Smell you later. Always not a pleasure, Mr. Jon Snow. What is this? Oh. Rest in peace, Kazuki Takahashi. Yes, uh, this is a very nice tribute um, to the maker of Yu-Gi-Oh! We're only here because of his vision, so... Thank you for the ROM hack maker for including this. This is a very nice gesture. I, I salute you, sir, for adding this in the game. I salute you. Your creation has touched the lives of so many people. You will be dearly missed. You know what? I think I will go and heal up at the Poké Center after this emotional tribute. He died a hero, too, so... That's a very nice tribute at the end of the video, guys. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. And we still didn't see Myotismon's um, normal-type move. We need to check that out. 
but definitely not on the monsters in Pokemon Tower, of course. So I think that is something that we will do in the next part. Should I lead with Biotisman? I think I will for uh, the tower. Let's see him more in action. So thank you all for sticking with me on this awesome part, and I will see you next part. Goodbye.